making direct receipts without sales invoices. From the gateway of Tally, select Vouchers. Select the right button Receipt. Verify that the entry date is correct, you can change the date using the date button. Select the cost center slash classes as not applicable if the income or sales does not have cost centers allocations. Select the cash or bank ledger in the account field with which you are making the receipt to. In the particulars field select the income or sales ledger. Leave the particulars field blank or select end of list to indicate the end of ledgers to be selected in this receipt. Press enter on the total receipt amount to go to the bank allocation window. Select the transaction type as others. Enter the source of the income in the received from field except the window to come back to the main voucher entry screen. Enter the narration if required and press enter. Accept to save the new receipt voucher. For the voucher type receipt if the option print voucher after saving is set to yes, on saving the voucher you will be prompted to print the official receipt. You may use the escape key to exit without printing. Altering receipt vouchers. You may use multiple methods to alter the receipt vouchers. In the voucher entry screen, simply press the page up key to go back to the previously entered voucher. Alternatively you may select day book from the main gateway of tally menu. The day book will show all the vouchers entered as of the current date. Use the button F2 to change the date or Alt and F2 to change the period. To alter, press Enter on the receipt voucher. To verify the receipt voucher entered, you can use the change mode button using Ctrl and H and select double entry. You will be able to view the voucher with debits and credits and verify that the total debit amount is equal to the total credit amount.